Above that, we want to um, thank our out and about sponsors, mm -hmm. Rector Hayden Versailles and uh, Republic State Mortgage, Becky, Becky Baldwin. Baldwin. Yes, RHR Versailles and Becky Baldwin. Yes, uh, they w without them, this this uh, sponsorship would would not be around. So thank you so much to them and their all their support. You're looking at them right now. Awesome people, awesome professionals. Um, you know, a funny fact, uh, Emily, that I learned that's, that's really interesting. So, you know, uh, Rector Hayden Versailles, right now, uh -huh. obviously Rector Hayden, um, we know all of the agents here. They're very local. We know them. We know their kids. We know right. everything about them. Uh, and they have this huge, amazing, uh, uh, backing from, you know, uh, home services, uh, uh and, and Rector yeah. Hayden, Lexington and everything. Uh, but these guys here in, in Versailles have, well, they work real hard, very, very hard. And they're very good at what they do. So last year, 2020, uh, people were still, I mean, they were still working hard. They were still going strong. I think total, they made 24 million in sales and then they have ramped it up this year. This just goes to show you how hard working they are. We've already sold, it's been six months and we've already sold 24. We've or we're already there for the full year last year. So that's how crazy it is right now. Yeah. So when I'm, when I've been on here and trying to look up listings and they're already gone, it's real. I'm not lying to yeah. you. Yeah. And when we say go to Becky first, because you need your pre-approval letter and get your plan of action. Yeah. If you need, if you're looking and aren't sure if you qualify yet, we, you know, that, you gotta that's go to a her real first. first step. Cause yes. the market is so hot that if it, if it comes up and you're interested, you gotta be ready to roll. Boom, 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 boom. So the next month I'd like to highlight a little bit about more of the inner workings about what they do, how Becky's involved, what an agent does. Uh, that's, so that's something that you can look forward to for July. Perfect time. Oh, summer. Seven. Great market. Great yes. market time. Move before school starts, right? Everybody likes to be settled in their new right. school district if you have kids before. Exactly. So it is a hot time to move. Hot time. Hot, hot time. <laughs> I was going to say, speaking of hot, but it was very comfortable in there. Very comfortable. We get to go to Robin's Airbnb. Love it. You guys, you probably drive by this every day. That's oh, what, totally. Uh, I mean, you've seen it a thousand times. You've probably seen the door. You've probably <laughs> noticed there's like a flower pot outside. Yeah. But you haven't noticed that it is actually a B&B &B downtown for sales. It sure is. It's, uh, yeah, I mean, it's a little, pe which, a little piece of her sales, right? A little piece of her sales. Well, you know, Robin, you saw her a couple of weeks ago. Um, Cornerstone, Robin. Cornerstone, yeah, with, with her sister. Lola, Robin. Uh, let, I'm going to let her tell you the story, but it's, it's great. We had a lot of fun there. We did, guys. Book, your, book your travel, and we'll see you next time, right? We'll do that. We'll see you next time. We'll see you in July. See you in July. What's up, Woodford? We are here today at a little piece of Versailles, a great B&B &B right downtown Versailles, owned by Robin Reed. Robin... Tell us about this gym that you guys have. I think it's such a hidden door that people don't always know exists, but it is in the perfect location. It is perfect. It's across the street from the gallery, the wedding venue. Um, of course, downtown. It's close. You can walk. You can eat. Um, but it is kind of hidden. Yeah. Not and a lot of people know about it. That's kind of nice, though. You know, when you want to kind of come back at night and you want to retreat, you just want to kind of have that comfort and... and kind of safety and security, but yet you walk out and you're on Main Street now. That's right. So tell us, should we go in and see it? Um, sure. Because you have so many people that just stop in the drugstore and even say, you were telling us about a family who comes and says, Grandma and Grandpa are home, right? That's right. That's <laughs> right. They, they ended up staying, they rented it for a week and I think they ended up staying about 10 or 12 days. They just kept going, can we stay another night? Can we stay another night? They were a very sweet couple. That's yeah. awesome. Guys, let's check it out. Look at this gorgeous B and B here. Tall ceilings. It has the architecture of downtown. Beautifully decorated by Robin herself. It has every amenity you guys could think possible. And it comes with my favorite part is a dose of Robin Reed, who can give you all of the intel on what to do, where to eat, where to stay. I mean, Robin, you probably give out more tips to guests that stay here than you even knew what you knew about Brussels, right? Well, between the drugstore and here. Yes, I give out tips every single day <laughs> about all of Woodford County, though, not just downtown. Yes, that, yeah. that, that is true. That's a yeah. great point. She is our resident Woodford County Google, if you will. <laughs> um, so this place sleeps, it can sleep up to six or eight people, right? Yeah. 
there's a king size bed, couch makes a full size bed, and then I've got a um, roll away and an air mattress. Perfect. So. Let's take a look, Corey, in the bedroom here. It's right downtown, but it the you cannot hear anything outside. Very quiet. It's very, very quiet. But moments away from, like you said, if you're coming in for a wedding at the gallery or any of the churches downtown, um, a block party, our Twilight Festival, mm -hmm. all the Christmas festivities, you just want to come and stay somewhere downtown, centrally located. This is a wonderful, wonderful option. Robin, you guys are on Airbnb. How long have you been open? Well, we were open a year and a half, and then, as we all say, COVID hit. <laughs> so then everything was canceled. Um, we just started getting bookings again, March-ish, something like that. So, but I'm booked all the way through the end of September sales at Kingland right now. That is awesome. Um, and you say that, you know, obviously they can book on Airbnb, but they can also, if it's a local, they just want kind of a staycation or they've got family coming in town, they can text you, yes. call you, come into the drugstore yes. and see you. Absolutely. Right? Yep. Perfect. Um, so let's take them through. Do you want to take them to the kitchen area? Sure. And you can see the rest of this homey place. Guys, I mean, look at the wood finishings and the crown molding. This place is gorgeous. She it's is all like, original. The wood floors. It is a perfect, cozy home. Um, she also was talking about being able, a family that was able to come in. They went to Rolling Oven Pizza. They ended their night a few nights in a row at the Amson Bourbon Bar. So much to do just moments away. But then, of course, you can get in your car or get in your tour operator bus, whatever you're going to do while you're here, and go about your merry way, right? Absolutely. Because you've got Woodfoot Reserve, the Stave, Castle and Key, and Glens Creek all in one little one little line. And you are a straight shot to Keeneland and anything yeah. in Lexington, the airport. What a cute, oh, an Amazon coffee mug oh, that you can get your coffee cup, at, you can get your coffee every morning. That's Corey's. Yeah. Corey Cooley. <laughs> Whoops. Leaving a mess already. <laughs> um, the exposed brick where you've got to show them just everything, every detail has been looked after here. How cute is this? You got Wi Fi, cable, satellite TV. Awesome. And of course the drugstore has great food. So even if you just wanted to walk downstairs, get something before your day out on the town, a tour, you know, whatever you're going to do, you want to fill your belly up. Um, but Robin also was telling us a story about how she recommends all the time uh, going to the marathon station to get a good breakfast sandwich to fill up before the day or walking to any of our other great restaurants we have downtown Versailles. And not only in Versailles, but of course Woodford County as a whole. So we're going into the kitchen. And she keeps it fully stocked, you guys. She has brochures and travel guides, everything you need in here. And Robin, what else? You guys have a curate. Can you tell a little bit about what they can find here? Um, anything. I keep bottled waters always, and there's extras in the closet. Uh, I always have a little gift basket for the guests that come. Oh, and my favorite <laughs> lunch at the Glitz. Where did you find this? Look, Emily. From started. Emily. <laughs> so is this a cooking book or a... Yes, it yes. is. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. You've never seen that? No, I've never seen it. But now I need to get my hands on one of these. Oh, my gosh. There is Emily herself. Yeah. How awesome is this, you guys? A lunch at the Glitz. Emily McCauley. That is perfect. What a good Woodford County touch. I'm telling you guys, she has thought, Robin has thought of everything here. Washer, uh, is there a bathroom? And, oh. We'll do the washer dryer. Washer dryer. Okay. Here. Great facilities. They truly have everything. Um, you walk just right out from Main Street, right up a, few, a quick flight of steps, and you're right here in the suite, this little piece of Versailles. I love that you named it that because I think that is truly what this encapsulates, right? It does. Yeah, it sure does. We also have, um, I always have coffee. Nobody has to bring their own coffee. I even have Bailey's for her coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Woman after bone heart. That's right. That's right. And I have all the sanitizers, bleach, all the rags that they need for. Said like a true pharmacist, you guys. She's going to keep you it healthy it. and you happy. You got it. <laughs> and then we have a washer and dryer in here. Perfect. Guys, this is so unique. Not every Airbnb is going to come with these types of amenities. Robin truly has checked off everything. This is the perfect, again, it sleeps six 
to eight folks. You can sleep very comfortably here. Minimal noise, but such access to everything that you need right at your fingertips. So Robin, what made you guys decide to open this up as an Airbnb downtown for sale? When we bought the building, Danny Dawson owned this building and when his mom passed away and he was gonna move to her house on um, off of Broadway. Blackbird. Blackbird, yeah. He came to me and he said, I think you should buy this building. And I was like, okay. So we did. And it was just an apartment, but he lived here for years. So I rented it to someone and then I just got this bright idea that it would make a cool Airbnb. So they just happened the renters moved. So I decided not to rent it again and we remodeled and that's what you got. This is perfect. There, there are apartments downtown for sales and you know some places to live, but this is truly unique because this is one of the only, if not the only, Airbnb that I know of downtown for sales. Is that, is that, was that? No. No, there's more? Um, on the corner, the alley. Okay, yeah. Upstairs of the upholstery. Oh, yes, Fair Alex. Mason. Yes, yes, Alex Mason. Yes. That's yes. right, that's right. I um, think. Yes, I there. think you are right now that you say that. Um, but again, guys, there's not many options downtown. You know, you go to other cities and this is a very, very common thing. So we love it. It's great atmosphere. It's where people are. Um, it's where businesses, you know, you can come, you can do everything that you want. If you don't have a car, if you've kind of flown in, you're, there's so much that's in walking distance. So this is such a cool location as well. It's, it's done really well. And people are so... I barely even have to clean after people leave. It's amazing how they're so respectful. That is awesome. Yeah. I'm so glad to hear that. Yes. So Robin, tell them again, somebody's family's coming in town. Um, you know, you're talking about already being booked up through September. So think about the holidays, guys. Think about your Thanksgiving guests, your Christmas guests. Go ahead and get on Robin's calendar. It's never too early to give her a call. Get on the Airbnb, you can check out the pictures for yourself. I'm sure she'll be happy to show you around. Um, but if somebody wants to find you, tell them again how they get in touch with you to book. They can Airbnb, obviously, or you can call Cornerstone Pharmacy at 859-873-3007 and ask for me. And you get the Miss Robin as a sad with your Airbnb. That's set. right. <laughs> <laughs> no tips needed. She, she comes complimentary. Guys, that's it for now. Thank you so much. That's what's up in Woodbridge. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.